Crates are excellent for potty training and make things so much easier. The reason they work so well is because a dog's natural instinct is to keep their den clean. Basically, dachshunds don't like to wee or poo where they eat and sleep. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique, guide is in the description below. Crates keep your dachshunds safe and secure. Crates keep your dachshunds safe overnight and when you're not in the room. So, if you have to nip to the loo or answer the door, you know your pup is safely contained. If you leave him to wander freely around your home, he could chew through wires or nibble the edges off your kitchen cupboards. Dachshunds can get up to all sorts of mischief if left to their own devices. How do you crate train a dachshund puppy? 1. Put the crate in your bedroom. It's number one advice for people who are having a rough go of it. As mentioned before, dachshunds have a tendency to suffer from extreme separation anxiety and loneliness especially puppies. They miss their moms. Placing the crate in your room can make all the difference, though. Always buy a crate based on a fully grown dachshund. When your puppy is really small, you can always put a dog bed, one with the squishy rounded sides, inside the crate to use up more space and make it feel smaller. 2. Put a bed, blankets, toys, rawhide and something that smells like you in the crate. It goes without saying that the dog should still be able to fit in the crate, and that he should have some space to move around. But make sure the little guy is comfortable. An uncomfortable dog is an unhappy dog. A cold dog is an unhappy dog. A bored dog is an unhappy dog. And it's a good idea not to move the crate, as dogs hunts like consistency. You might also want to spend some time helping the dog get acquainted with it. Put treats in there, and praise him when he goes in to get them. 3. Use a ticking clock or white noise. It's comforting to the dog, as it reminds him of its mother. A heartbeat sheep is a soft toy with a small device inside that produces a heartbeat vibration that mimics his mums. The heartbeat will comfort your dachshund and help him with any separation anxiety. 4. Drape a blanket over the crate. Make sure the front part isn't covered, that way the pup can breathe. But dogs are den animals, and feel safe in confined, dark areas. Put a soft base or cushion inside the crate with some warm blankets. Drape the sides and back of the crate with a blanket to create a snuggle den, but leave the front open so your dachshund can see out. Alternatively, buy a fabric pet cover for your dog crate. The extra darkness also signifies that it's bedtime. 5. Take the dog out about an hour before bed, and don't serve him additional food or water when you get back. Of course, make sure he's eating and drinking throughout the day so as not to torture the poor thing. But it's equally tortious to put him in a crate when he needs to relieve himself. Also, don't take him out right before bed, as he might confuse this with playtime. 6. Have quiet time before bed. Dachshunds especially puppies have a lot of energy, and it's very important that they burn it off during the day. 7. Limit the number of times you take him out throughout the night, and make them quick. If you make a fuss over him every time you take him out, he'll associate barking, howling and crying with getting what he wants, you. Instead, take him out of the crate, quickly bring him outside, and then quickly put him back in the crate after he's done his business. No love, as harsh as that sounds. In terms of how often you should be taking the little guy out throughout the night, a good rule of thumb is every couple of hours when they're brand new, and then once or twice per night after three or four weeks. 8. What if things gets bad? If things get bad, sleep on the floor next to the crate, in the bedroom, for a couple of nights. It'll teach the dog that he has nothing to be afraid of, and that you're not going anywhere. 9. Make some sound. If things get really bad, shaking a can filled with pennies can help. This should only be used as a last resort, since you don't want to make your dog a nervous wreck. But dachshunds aren't big fans of loud noises, and the penny can, can eradicate bad behavior. Use some light noise or music to make him feel safe and silent. 10. Never cave and let the dog sleep with you. Once you've got your puppy going in and out on his own, it's time to shut the crate door. 
Start with two minutes at a time and build slowly from there. Stay in the room but act like it's no big deal. He may cry or whine a little, but don't stress or he'll pick up on this. You need to stay calm and carry on like you normally do. Remain strong, and remember that it will get better. It isn't hard to crate train a dachshund puppy, but there is some tough love involved. Dachshunds are very loyal and attach themselves intensely to their owners, so may put up some resistance about going in the crate at first. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.